Hey everyone, welcome back to another video and this video I'm going to talk about how to make an object transparent in the Roblox Studio. So can directly get into a step. So the first one I have to go over here, search for the Roblox and from here you have to get into the Roblox Studio. Now we'll just wait for the loading up the procedures to get completed and once you get into the Roblox Studio, this is what you have to do. First I have to get into one of my last savings and once I open up my Roblox last savings and the studio, just wait for a little bit of time and this is how it looks like. Now I'm having an object over here as you can see. The first step, famous step in order to make it transparent, this is what you have to do. Let me select the object that I feel like I wanted to make it transparent and I have to, after selecting, I have to go over here the spawn location and right now I have, I can see there is a lot of things over here on the right side. We have a similar appearance, data, a lot of things. From here we can change many things. So in order to make it transparent, I have to select the box over here or any object that I wanted to change it. Afterwards, I have to go over here in the transparency and make sure when you click on the box and it's selected, you will be having a blue icon over here on the, in the corners. And once you select it, you can see there is a transparent, you can give the value. Or you have a scape where you can move it over here like this. Right now, as you can see, while I'm moving my thing over here, it's completely visible right now. If I bring it back, as you can see, the object is there. So let me go over here and make it like this and it is completely visible. So I'll let me keep this for the time being. And also, apart from this, you can change the material of the particular object. You can various are under here in the material. We have various options. If I expand this, you can see we have options like leather, limestone, marble, metal, mud, neon, pavement, pebble, plastic, etc. You can change it. So let me get it on limestone over here or I'll keep it on the marble and this is how it looks like. Now if I want to change the colors I have the color palette I can click on this one where I can get completely the details over here or I can change the colors that I wanted to use in the color palette over here. I can do it as per the needs and I can completely change it. And right now this looks like a low color of a marble. So what I'm going to do is let me go over here in the transparency and I'm going to change over here I'm going to expand this up. Let me completely make it transparent I'm going to make it transparent like this. Now the object which I was there in the first of the video is not yet completely transparent and now you can save it and so what you have to do. And I hope this video really is helpful and if you find this video helpful, don't forget to subscribe and click on the bell icon for more notification. That's it. Bye bye.